this video you're about to see, I've got some of my more recent pastels that I've done uh, working towards a solo show next September. And my show is going to be called Industrial Commercial. And it's all of the industrial scenes and commercial businesses that are uh, nearby along a stretch of road, uh, mostly Canton Road, but some others as well. And I uh, hope you enjoy it. Over the past year or so, I've been working in pastel, some watercolors, but mostly pastel, along the stretch of road uh, here in Marietta, uh, Canton Road. And there's been a few other styles. Burrow Road is one. But uh, doing small businesses, um, lots of trucks, lots of cars, parked cars. Um, again, like I said, small businesses, indoor sites, the cement hopper, um, delivery trucks, or this is a tire repair shop. Um, a lot of chain link fences, for, for instance. There are a few natural studies like these, uh, the next door neighbor's house in the snow, their birdhouse, uh, but the commercial thing, the mail trucks and the uh, workers trucks here uh, have really caught my eye recently. This little church school bus and a red Toyota, uh, another uh, daycare school bus, uh, these buses that are Painted up uh, as signage have caught my eye. This one for a uh, local bar. Um, cars in general, the high power lines, the tension lines, the the telephone lines in general have caught my eye recently. This is uh, in a industrial park. Most recently, I've begun to notice billboards, and uh, not that I've never noticed them before, but. Uh, is a subject for artwork and um, putting them in as a dominant feature in my recent pastels. Uh, been enjoying uh, adding them in as a major factor and striving towards something a little bit more abstract. Uh, this one here, perhaps, uh, but this next one this one here is, is pretty much where I'm trying to get to with my work. And uh, that being a uh, design for perhaps a big oil in the future. But um, go ahead and browse the rest of these. And uh, I've got a little demo coming up that I hope you enjoy and get something out of. Over on Canton Road, it's been my focus for pretty much the past year. Uh, I keep finding new subjects to paint down there. And the train tracks run parallel to it. And there's often um, tanker cars that are lined up. And there's a fill point where my neighbor pointed out that a windsock hangs over it to show you the direction that the chemical fumes will be going if they ever have a, an accident or a spill. Give you a little rundown of how I work uh, doing my plain air pastels and uh, I'm going to show you this piece that uh, I did in progress. First I find a site uh, driving around up and down Canton Road and to kind of frame my picture and then I choose my colors, uh, make sure my pencils are sharp. These are Conti pencils for the most part. And uh, then 
decide on a composition and start to frame it up into my into my piece and to, onto my paper using vertical and horizontal lines and then filling in masses of color usually with with uh, crosshatch lines and then blend them in together this is on a dark background paper a navy blue so most of the colors are brighter than uh, the background paper except for black of course and uh, I have no hesitation in using black I like to use black um, and gradually the piece starts to pull together here I'm filling lighter sky and uh, because the sky is usually the lightest value on a piece and then finishing it off with the telephone lines which I've only recently begun to enjoy and appreciate as uh, an element in my artwork and uh, then here is uh, pretty much the finished piece I don't know if that helps you at all but uh, there it is I invite you to view my website DonaldMayerArtistWebsites.com and uh, see the rest of my work, oils, pastels, watercolors, and perhaps uh, you can order a print. Downtown Marietta is an excellent uh, place to do uh, this type of artwork, but uh, as I have told you already, I've been working along Canton Road quite a bit. Also doing pastels while my wife does the grocery shopping or bouncing around town looking for isolated places, especially on Sundays when uh, most of these companies are closed. I can drive into their parking lot and, and draw their trucks or whatever. Especially since I got my nighttime glasses. I bought a pair of uh, eyeglasses at the drugstore with two lights on each side and has allowed me to get out in the evening and not have to worry about drawing under a bright lamppost, but uh, can pretty much do nighttime uh, scenes anywhere I want to. So that's a, a nice ability to have. Driving into these parking lots on a Sunday especially to do these pastels has given me an idea to develop a artistic license. I'm sure you've all heard of such a thing, but I've never seen one. So I've had the idea of forging a official looking artist license that I can whip out if I ever get stopped doing these pastels in places that I shouldn't be. Winters have become my preferred time to paint because of the barrenness of the trees. I like the structure in them. But spring is always a relief and a colorful one at that. And can't ignore the spring foliage. try to make my show in September in Ackworth at Gallery 4463. All these pieces have been done from the cab of my Ford Ranger, actually behind the steering wheel, so they, uh, out of necessity, had to be very small. And because they're small, they will be priced very low. So I hope that is an incentive for you to consider coming to the show and perhaps uh, making a purchase. I'd uh, love to uh, add you to my collector's list. Anyway, this is Don Mayer. Hope to see you someday. So long.